So what are we looking at here? This is methane leaking into the atmosphere. Now methane is a really powerful greenhouse gas, about 80 times more powerful than carbon dioxide. So a really big part of the climate change problem. This video shows methane leaking out of this infrastructure. You can see it from the movement coming out and heading upwards. This is only detectable with an infrared camera and not to the naked eye. Now, the Australian Conservation Foundation and a global nonprofit called the Clean Air Task Force went out into New South Wales and Queensland to about 35 different sites in gas wells and coal mines and gas pipelines and used this infrared camera to see if gas was leaking. And they found more than 100 places where it was leaking into the atmosphere. Gas leaks were found at infrastructure owned by a few different companies. They include the energy giants Origin and Santos and the gas pipeline company Gemina. These claims were immediately rejected by two of the companies named. Origin and Santos said they checked their gas wells after the claims were raised with them and they found no leaks. The Australian Conservation Foundation and Clean Air Task Force say there were at least 25 visible leaks along Gemina's pipelines in Queensland and New South Wales. They say there were at least 10 visible leaks from Origin's coal seam gas wells in Queensland and that methane was being released from four of seven coal seam gas wells owned by Santos in the Pillager Forest in New South Wales. Now, not everything that is leaking in these videos may be methane, but it is the largest component of natural gas. We should say there's no suggestion of illegality here or that the companies are trying to hide their emissions. The issue is whether enough is being done to monitor and prevent leaks and unnecessary venting. So why does this matter? Well, we know from what scientists tell us that there's a lot more methane in the atmosphere than companies are reporting that they're releasing. It's gotta be coming from somewhere. There is an expectation, and there is, has been previous evidence that there might be widespread leaks from mines and pipelines. We really need to crack down on this if we're gonna be serious about the climate crisis. Countries have made commitments to make deep cuts in methane by 2030. Detecting where this methane is coming from is obviously an important first step in getting there. So this footage should be useful and hopefully will lead to further action.